Hello YouTubers, this is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. So on this YouTube channel, I like to do a lot of PC help. I like to do a lot of tutorials to help people in dire need when they have a computer that's running slow, infected with viruses and stuff like that, and they go to a PC repair place and it costs them a lot of money. So today guys, I have a client's computer that's running Windows 7, and it is very slow, it's buggy, blue screen the dead, it's rebooting itself, it's infested with viruses. So today guys, I'm gonna show you from the beginning all the way to the end how I fix my client's computer. It's running Windows 7, but you can do this with Windows XP, Windows Vista, Windows 7, Windows 8, Windows 10, any PC that you could do this tutorial with. So let's go on and get started with the tutorial. Get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. What's up guys this is Eric again with another video so today guys I'm booting up this machine this is a laptop for a customer and it's an HP uh, pavilion uh, DV7 4179 for a customer and uh, as you can tell I booted it up it, it's taking an awful long time to boot up uh, it has an AMD process I don't know how many gigs of RAM it has but uh, it's definitely definitely slow so uh, I'm waiting on it to boot up guys so we can get it to the, uh, the the resetting process this is one of the reasons why people get frustrated after they have a PC for a long uh, period of time uh, they get infested with viruses and stuff like that so they need some help so today guys I'm just want to kind of show you real quick real easy on how to fix the PC now, so uh, I mean give it a few minutes to see if it's gonna boot up let's go to a fast forward the video and I'm gonna let this run until we get to some type of operating system right now we are definitely in the dire state and this computer will not boot up into the OS uh, and this is probably the frustration that a lot of people having right now so as you can see the windows is just circling and circling and circling it's nothing happening so I mean we about to hit the 20 minute mark and nothing's happening with this PC so what I'm gonna do guys I'm just gonna press the home I mean the uh, power button all right, let's turn it off. And shouts out to my Superman shirt here. Yes, let's go on turn this PC back on, and let's go to hit F10. Now, if you have a different PC, PC besides a HP, uh, you may have to hit F9, F12, F11. But uh, on the HP uh, laptops and PCs, uh, I had to. I, I only had to hit uh, F10 to get into uh, to set up this utility. All right, so. Um, what I'm gonna do guys, real simple, is I'm gonna just get out of this. I'm gonna exit, all right? And what this is gonna do is take me to another menu. Uh, this is the easy way I like to do this, by the way. This is gonna take me to another menu. So right now, it's telling me that my Windows did not shut down successfully, and that's fine. Let's go into safe mode, all right? And let's go down to reset this PC in safe mode. Bypass all that crap that we just saw uh, with your PC just turning and spinning and turning and spinning. That doesn't work. So at this point, we're gonna bypass all of that and we're gonna just do a real simple, real easy way to, to, to fix this PC, get rid of everything and start this like you just bought the PC. So let's go down and go into administration. I, uh, the administrative account, make sure you know your passwords. If not, then again, uh, they got a lot of stuff on the web on how to, you know, uh, clear your password. It's no big deal. Uh, so, uh, so right now it's getting into safe mode and safe mode is, is totally faster than going into, uh, the regular mode that I was, it was circling for 20 minutes and that's a no go. All right. So right now, guys, we're in safe mode. I mean, it took no time to get in safe mode all right so right now we're in safe mode and listen we're just not going to mess around with it we just go in and it even in safe mode it's, it's pretty slow all right so let's go to the real simple and, and i'm looking at some of the apps that the customer have uh cc cleaner optimize your pc all that type of stuff these are the problems that you run into look at that cloud antivirus listen guys <laughs> download this stuff rebate blaster listen it, it, this is the, the the stuff that help that hurts your pc by the way so i'm gonna do something real simple guys only thing i'm gonna do is go to my search and search restore 
factory restore. Right? There it is. All right, so I put in factory restore, say restore your PC, restore your computer, or reinstall Windows. Look at that. Real simple. So basically, guys, I just want to go to scroll down. Real easy. Booyah. Now, at this point, everything that you have on your PC is going to get erased. So if you didn't save or if you didn't back up none of your files and documents and stuff like that, uh, you might have to back all this up before you get to this point. All right, so now, at this point, I want y'all guys to see this. You want to go to what's called Advanced Recovery Method. Advanced Recovery Method. Real simple, real easy. You got two options here. You got Return a Use System Image to create an earlier or uh, to recover your computer. Nope, because we, I don't have a system image right now for this PC. Or they say return your computer to factory condition. What this does, this option will delete everything on your computer and replace it with the recovery image provided by your computer's manufacturer. All right. So it also give you some disclaimers that um, make sure you back up everything you have, back everything up before you do this process. But uh, the client. Uh, that gave me this PC, told me that there's nothing on this PC that they want. There's nothing that they want backed up. They want everything completely wiped, completely done. Booyah, let's get it done. So uh, basically, guys, you want to just click here. Real simple. All right. And they say Windows backup cannot run if this computer is running in a safe mode. All right. So let's go down and restart. All right, so now you're gonna start getting pop-up menus here. Uh, so right now it's asking me uh, US or whatever type of uh, keyboard input, uh, whatever country that you're in, you wanna click the download menu and select your country of choice. So I'm in the US, so I'm going to go to the, click, click the US. Now it's telling me if I uh, need any help and I'm going to do a, uh, a, a system restore, all right? All right, so this process restores your computer to out of the box state. Again, if you dis if you bought a PC, this will do it out of the box state. This will get you fully recovered. So we're gonna recover without backing up any files. And the reason why is because some of the files may be corrupted. So we're gonna go down and do a clean slate. All right, again, all everything should be disconnected keyboard mouse if you got anything that's external let's go on and do this all right and again uh listen this is this is kind of do this at your own risk guys um and right now it's reinstalling all the original software and once this is completed i'm gonna go through let y'all guys see everything that is going to be a brand new fresh computer right out of the box so stay tuned all right, guys, so the recovery is done here. Uh, so now the PC is asking me to uh, go it on and hit finish. So I'm doing the finish here. Uh, all right, guys, so right now we had our welcome screen. You got to type in the username. So uh, the, the client name uh, was dog. So <laughs> uh, we're gonna put his name back in. Uh, he had to capitalize. So I'll put the, uh, the, the username back in and I'm gonna hit next. Uh, and um, so it's asking me to accept all the license and agreements and stuff like that. So I'm doing that there. I'm going to do recommended settings. Uh, time is right. And so uh, what I did was I bypassed the password. I hit finish twice, bypassed the password because I don't want to put a password in. Uh, the client can go back in and put their own password in. So I'm going to leave it open for the client. Uh, if the computer asks me to put in a password, I will just put in a generic password for the client. Now at this point, uh, Windows 7 Home Premium is just finalizing, finishing all the settings and stuff like that. And uh, we almost done with this tutorial. So, I'm getting a prompt saying, welcome to your new HP computer. When you buy this PC, this is the welcome screen that you're going to get when you first buy the computer. Uh, so this computer has been completely factory reset. And now it's going to ask me for the uh, setup here if I want to register this computer and the stuff like that. So it's going to give me some uh, st steps here and it's going to take me through all steps to register this PC and everything. So it should get me close to the home screen here. And I say thank you. And uh, remember in the beginning of the video, guys, I, I, it took at least 
almost 20 minutes, 20 and so more minutes, and it was just spinning. It was just spinning. It's the same PC. And so uh, I went into safe mode, and I showed you guys how to quickly get into safe mode. And in safe mode, which you can get into safe mode fairly easy, fairly quick, all I did was I went into search, and I hit recovery. And I just typed in recovery, and booyah, we are up and running. Uh, so uh, this process took me about an hour. All right, so everything, everything that was on this PC is completely done. Uh, nice wallpaper by H, uh, HP, by the way. Uh, so now the client has a brand new PC, uh, basically saved them hundreds of dollars. I don't know how much they pay for the PC, uh, but for my services, uh, it's about half the cost of the PC. So it's real simple, guys. You could do this at your own risk. And that's it, guys. So we are good. Everything is working properly. So the, the client now has a brand new PC and they can do whatever they want with it. This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. Leave your questions down below. Let me know what you think about this, guys, and all this glory. If you need any help, guys, please leave your questions down below uh, and for any assistance. Also, I have a playlist that's called Computer Help. I will put this video in that playlist uh, if you want to browse through different uh, videos that I have as far as computer help. This is Eric. See you guys on the next video. Peace.